your boy, Moto Steve, coming to you from that place right across from the Detroit River. That's Windsor, Ontario, Ontario. I am a Canadian motor vlogger and out for another ride on the Buell, better known as Kelly, the redheaded psycho child. But how are you guys doing? If you're new to my channel, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, leave a comment down below. If you're uh, uh, already a subscriber, then hey, leave me a comment. I would love to hear from you. How's everyone doing? Well, this weekend, big, big weekend, Mother's Day weekend in May, going actually to Niagara Falls to meet up with a bunch of people that I've known since I was a kid. And there's one person there that I'm really, really looking forward to. And that's the person that got me into riding. I always wanted to ride, always, you know, wanted to have a motorcycle, never knew how to ride. This guy, his name's Pat, was my best friend growing up. And at 16 years old, he bought a 1984 Honda 450 Nighthawk. And couldn't believe it, you know, a 16 year old kid with a bike working at a gas station. And I would go to the gas station and hang out with him. And I always thought his bike was so cool. And I wanted to learn so bad. So in this gas station while he was working, he actually taught me how to ride a motorcycle. Told me how to change the gears, explain friction, clutch, the whole nine yards. This 16 year old kid taught another 16 year old kid how to ride. And he would let me take his bike in the gas station and go up and down the gas station. It was a big gas station so I could get it up to second gear so I could actually get the feel of how it was. And right after that summer, I said to myself, that's it, I am doing it. And I went and worked the whole winter at a crappy, crappy job. And I put money away. And lo and behold, my cousin and my brother had bought a bike together. And they were scrapping over who can ride it, what times they can ride it and everything. So they decided, this is not working out. We are going to end up hating each other over this bike. So let's sell it. So my brother gave up his rights and I just had to pay my cousin off. The bike brand new was 3000 bucks. It was a 1984 VF 500 Interceptor Honda. Beautiful, beautiful bike. What an amazing bike to learn how to ride on. I had that bike and I got it with 11,000 kilometers. And when I sold it, it had 92,000 on it. And that was only at a couple of years. That wasn't uh, like a lifetime. That was uh, that was literally four or five years and I had already put on that many kilometers. Absolutely amazing bike. What an amazing friend to teach me how to ride. We're meeting up this weekend. He still rides. He has a uh, 2006 or five 750 shadow he's a little guy and that bike is perfect for him but yeah what a guy Patrick you are my hero brother because I am now in my 50s and I ride all the time I have this YouTube channel and if it wasn't for Pat helping me out I don't know if I ever would have actually rode a bike to be honest and uh, just wanted to say, man, this guy is a rock star because, like I said, 30, 30 plus years later, I, uh, I am still riding every day and absolutely loving it. But anyways, just a short little story from Moto Steve. Pat, once again, you're a rock star. Can't wait to see you this weekend in Niagara Falls. It's going to be a blast. Anyways, people, if you're new to the channel, thanks for coming out and watching me. Hit that subscribe button. It will help me immensely. I would love to hit 1,000 subscribers this summer. That would be the coolest thing ever. But anyways, guys, you're you. I'm me. I love you guys. I'm Moto Steve. And in a second... I will be out, but I gotta shut the camera off with my one hand. And I am out. <laughs>